Good evening. This is Dave Query coming at you from my uh, dock here on Fox Lake near Detroit Lakes, Minnesota. Once again for Dave's Dock Talk. And uh, give you a quick scan of the lake this evening. A bit of a breeze going. We got a few, uh, few ripples out there, nothing too terrible. It's a uh, darn pleasant evening nonetheless. It's uh, probably 75-ish still, and it's almost nine. <coughs> My uh, pooch seems to be enjoying it as usual. <coughs> Just caught a bass here a few minutes ago, and, and uh, she's much more excited about it than I am. <laughs> She's more of a fish dog lately, apparently. At any rate, uh, pardon me, I left my regular glasses in the car. Um, did uh, 12 hours at work, uh, just mowed the lawn, and now the wife isn't feeling so good, and I think we're going to have to take her in. She's in getting ready right now. And uh, But in the meantime, I just figured I'd cut a quick video here as quick as I can make it. I wanted to uh, talk briefly about uh, a book that the, we're getting into on the uh, Think and Grow Rich call. And uh, Paul Hutchings is uh, off for a few days and a few uh, other folks have been filling in, uh, Doc Fran and uh, John Chapman, uh, two great members of our mastermind. And uh, They've got in the last few days. Uh, it's uh, it's one of those books that's uh, going to be a, a, a an intense read. I've spent two days and haven't gotten through the first chapter yet. But uh, if you'd like, uh, we can get you a copy, a PDF copy. I'll see what I can do about uh, getting a link to it below the uh, video here. At any rate. The new book is called The New Psycho-Cybernetics, a book that was written back in 1960, I believe, and uh, it has been uh, rewritten, uh, kind of updated, you know, still keeping with the, uh, the basic theme of the original, but the part that we're going through anyway uh, starts uh, talking what the basis of the book about is apparently is the self-image and uh, apparently my dog has a rather sorry self-image right now because she's so sad because nobody's paying attention to her you know? it's a hard life anyway the uh, self-image as the book states, is basically the, the basis of our entire being, our entire personality, how we see ourselves, whether we realize how we see ourselves or not. We have a basically a hardwired self-image that whenever we attempt to do something that is out of the ordinary, no matter how many times we try, we... Uh, fail and it's basically a built-in fail-safe mechanism that the uh, the brain has d evolved over time in that we cannot do what our brain is programmed that it is outside of what it knows we can do so that is not to say that there's nothing that can be done and you can never change yourself. What must be done is to work on your self-image. Now, I have ideas based on a few other books that uh, we've gone through with Think and Grow Rich and The Science of Getting Rich, but I think this book delves in deeper to what must happen before we can change our self-image, the, the yardstick by which our brain measures whether or not we can accomplish what it is, be it 
a uh, a pro athlete, be it a you know a CEO of a business, uh, you know, down to a, a waitress. I mean, I was in restaurant for years, and you'd see waitresses that would just come up through the ranks, and you know, be in a place three to six months, and they were a manager. They were running the place. And you'd see others uh, that had been there 20 years and just all they could be is a waitress and that's all they saw themselves as. And until you start seeing yourself as more than you currently are, you will never be more than you currently are. At least that's what I got out of it. Uh, if you've read it, uh, Lend me your thoughts. Uh, if you haven't read it, uh, hopefully I can get a uh, link. Uh, I did get a copy of it myself, a PDF, uh, through one of our uh, group members. I'm going to try and get it uh, below this video. So, with that, leave me your uh, insights, your comments, concerns. Click the uh, link below. Uh, you may find that uh, I'm a decent guy and uh, you might want to join us in business and uh, you'll find the Think and Grow Rich call numbers underneath this video as well so again I'll leave you with a parting shot this evening of the uh, of uh, Fox Lake here and uh, I probably ought to get in here and fire up the fire up the ride and take the little woman in again she's not feeling so good so uh, hopefully that uh, works out say bye Abigail Abigail say bye bye <laughs> bye folks